Okay, welcome. I'm going to just give you an on-hand review of the Sanren Mu, the unboxing of it, and uh, just show you a few things. Uh, this is what I'll go through. I'll show out of the box. I'm not going to talk about the specs. You can look at them on the web. Look at price delivery, what it looks like, opening and locking and cutting, and a comparison with other knives. Sanren Mu, as you know, is, uh, Chinese knives. Uh, comes in a box like this. Took about three weeks. Fabulous. No trouble at all. Okay, uh, and this is the one I'm reviewing. In the bag came a little note from Customs from, I guess, S1, whoever that is, uh, saying that the items, no items have been removed. Okay, so I got through Customs, Australian Customs, all right. You know, on the back, you can see the guarantee of quality and uh, that sort of stuff. This came from Singapore. Over there, let's take it out of the plastic. It's a solid little number, actually. I was quite impressed with it. You can see it there, turning it over. Once again, uh, I'm not gonna give you the specs. This is just so you can see what it looks like. It's got a little pocket clip, the belt clip. Hmm. Uh, the blade itself, it's got quite a nice little thumb stud, which uh, well, I thought was loose, but actually you press it in to open it, then you can see the liner lock there is pretty good. It's certainly solid enough. I mean, it's, it's quite heavy. The blade's good. Let me uh, have a look at what we're going to go through here. So the price you've got, the delivery, the look, that's what it looks like. It's a nice look. Uh, opening and lock, you can see that uh, cutting. So let's grab a piece of paper. Um, uh, we've got a spare bit here, somewhere. Somewhere, somewhere, somewhere. Uh, not that the sharpness coming from China is necessarily an indication, but I mean, it certainly does the job. Don't know if it, it'll hit cut. No, it doesn't. Okay. So, sharp enough, and uh, the type of steel means it can be sharpened. I quite like this one, actually. And, uh, okay, so, line lock, closing it up. Comparing it to other knives. There's that. What else have we got? Got the Spyderco Delica. The, of course, the Swiss Army knife. I've got a little, one of my favourite knives, which is the Laguiol, a beautiful knife. And if we open this up, you can see it in comparison to the other knives there. Okay, that's all I wanted to show you. As I said, you can pick the specs up on the web, so now you see what it's like in hand, opening, and as I said, it's a solid little number.